singing like Girl, you know I want your love Your love was handmade for somebody like me Come on now, follow my lead I may be crazy, don't mind me Say, boy, let's not talk too much Grab on my waist and put that body on me Good morning guys, so we are now doing the Five Island Tour and uh, we paid 600 baht and we're now headed to our long tail boat at the pier. Hello. Those are all fish right there, like that's gotta be at least a few thousand fish, damn. And we're off. So we just arrived at a first stop. This here is Shark Bay. And the reason it's called Shark Bay is because there's actually sharks you might see here. Sharks, turtles, but apparently they're lame sharks, so they don't eat humans, they just eat coral. Right now, I'm flying the drone, I got my co-pilot. What's your name? Patloy? I think his name's Patloy. trying to learn Thai for some time and uh, we're gonna see if it works because she's gonna ask the little boy what his name is because we tried asking him he doesn't know what we're saying <laughs> I actually have to do it <laughs> ask him We've arrived at the second stop. Stay lit, my dudes. Stay lit, my dudes. The water here is super salty, so you float pretty well. It's also extremely clear. You can see lots of fish. Um, I know that the coral line here is not as good as it used to be because there's so much traffic that comes through here. Everything from boats polluting to people coming through. So the odds that you see like bigger fish or turtles or mini sharks is pretty unlikely. Most of the sea creatures know not to hang around this area, but it's definitely a good little day trip to go and explore beautiful Kotao. Kids don't try this at home. Josh is a trained expert. His family's from Barbados and they basically have to be fish <laughs> to live there. I think you just need to like take it easy, just like swim down slowly. Because the more you like paddle, the more you use your energy. Yeah. I'll try to do it again. For me, I like try to marathon or like sprint it down and then I like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can't. I just try to like time like how much air I'm gonna have going back up because that's the sketchy part. Captain right. Fun says, I gotta do Back to that. the boat. Bye bye, four. bye, 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 bye. A little bit of free diving here with Josh. Try Hain. That was so fun. Dude, that's impressive. Well, we gotta see if we can do it at the next place. How's the banana? Good banana? <laughs> you can see have the yellow line. Go inside the yellow line. Have a lot of coral, a lot of fish. This is our final stop before we have some lunch on the boat. And today, still no islands. Still no islands though. Oh yeah, that's true. Let's go. Yeah, this is not a five island tour. Five beach tour maybe, yeah. It was advertised as a five island tour, but this is uh, like a five beach tour. Not what we bought, but it's cool. It's a really nice day to see Koh Tao, and it's uh, actually a lot bigger of an island than I expected. Touching some rays. So this is really similar to when Laura and I got our patty. We spent like two days on a boat just like this, and they have a coffee station, which is just hot water and like this coffee grind. Yeah, it's some coffee made in there. You got a box of cookies. Life's pretty good on the sea. It was my favorite part of getting my patty, was eating the cookies. I didn't like getting the patty, it wasn't very fun. Remember after my first dive, I was like, I hate this because it's really claustrophobic. 
and then after like the second and third i started to enjoy it but it i don't know it's still kind of like stressful especially to getting your patty you have to do horrible things like take your mask off underwater yeah that's not and fun. i can't like not breathe through my nose like i have to have my nose plugged and i thought i was gonna die <laughs> getting your patty is basically like doing a safety course you spend a lot of time in the classroom spend a lot of time doing the stuff that's not fun so that you can get to the fun stuff. It's hard for me to say that you shouldn't do it because you never know if you'll use it again down the road, but I'm gonna say that probably most people who get their patties will never dive after that. It's a fairly inexpensive place to get your patty, so if you know you're gonna do some diving, Koh Tao is the place to do it. I threw my coffee in the water and all of these fish came running for it. Let's throw a biscuit. Mm -hmm. Oh, not the buttons! Come drop Here they come. Look oh, at the big look one. The big one. Oh my gosh, that's a beautiful one. Beautiful. Ah. Mm -hmm. I hear you calling out my name. Yeah, I hear you. Hey, same old game. I like this kid on the back of the boat. Yeah. Hello. This is the fifth and final stop at Koh Nang Yun. Uh, we're actually not gonna go on the island because it's 100 baht and we were here yesterday. We don't have time for that. And we ain't got time for that. So we're just gonna chill on the boat, uh, fly the drone because you're not actually allowed to bring your drone on the island as we found out yesterday. They confiscated our controllers. So here's a workaround. Either bring a Mavic because you can hide in your bag, they won't find out. Or bring two remotes and give them the dummy remote. But watch out because they have a gun. They also threatened they have a gun to shoot it down. Yeah. And we saw a fighter jet go by. Like it was so loud. I couldn't like figure out what was going on until I looked in the sky and there was like one of those uh, raptors. Is that what they're called? I think so. We think so. An amazing day. We now can say we've been all around Koh Tao and seen every single bit of it and a really beautiful island. How was your day? It was so good. Yeah. That was crazy to see it. It's nice to see so many different places in one day. Exactly. Like these tours that we've been going on have been so awesome. Yeah. Even just hanging out on the boat was nice. Oh yeah. Yeah. And being able to snorkel and stuff like that besides getting very crisp. <laughs> yeah, you're nice and crisp today. I definitely should have put more stuff in. <laughs> <laughs> see you later. Oh my gosh, no way. That's what What am I doing? What am I doing? What, what is going on? I was clearly so taken off guard. It looked like you were on the road for like 10 Oh my gosh. That is so funny. That is the most ingenious thing I've ever seen. Like, we are printed on those plates. I don't know what they're gonna do with them. Maybe they can peel it off. But uh, someone took my photo right here as we came in the gate. I had no idea why he was taking our photo. Uh, Tess, here, how was yours? Did it turn out? I look like I've been traveling for days. <laughs> Lost in the Sahara <laughs> Desert. Hell. I look so bad. This would not be the complete tour of Koh Tao if we didn't show you one of the things that makes Koh Tao so awesome, and that is the nightlife. I've been to Koh Tao twice now, and one of the things I've always loved is the thing we're going to next, which is... What are we the doing? Koh Tao Club Crawl, and Christian's done it a few times, so I've never tried it. I'm very excited. It's gonna be crazy! But, I'm gonna be leaving this big camera behind, so I'm gonna do a real nifty transition that looks a little something like... <laughs> Ooh. 
What's up guys? I wanted to finish off this vlog by giving a massive thank you to Thibault. Thibault is a friend of mine from Paris who I met through the internet. That's how I meet most people these days, but he is the one that created that incredible animation you just watched at the beginning of the video. I've been meaning to get something just like that made for ages now, but I've just been so busy and one day he shoots me an email out of the blue saying, hey, I would love to do an animation for you. Didn't ask for anything in return. He just wanted to be like a part of the channel, wanted to help out. And I wanted to thank you, Thibault, because it is so cool to have that. And if you guys want to check out his work, this is his Instagram handle. Check it out. Show him some love. And maybe if you're looking to have some animations done yourself, talk to him. You're also probably wondering, uh, you know, where is all the pub crawl footage? It's gone. <laughs> I don't know where it went. And the Wi-Fi here is not very good. So I tried to download Josh's footage. If you want to see more about the pub crawl, check out Josh's vlog, which I'll have linked down below, because he vlogged that more successfully than I did. Peace out, guys. Let's get lost again tomorrow.